Hey, what's going on YouTube? Look, look like throughout all this beef, you know what I'm saying? There's been a lot of people involved. A lot of people had a lot of different they were going to break, whether they were Hendrick, whether they were in the beef and fell out like J. Cole and some others like the Migos or what, you know what I'm saying? But we got the game, a rapper from Coast, a legendary rapper. You know about the game. You know what's going on the pop at all. Now game was a left out of the Kendrick performance the other day, if you don't know that. That up, Kendrick did a huge show during the Junior Fest, and uh, he had a lot of people on stage. Not one of them. A lot of people have questions for him because he wasn't on stage. Take a look at what Game has to say about that. Swirl around the internet, you know. Hey, look, before you get too deep into the video, go ahead and hit that like button. Drop a comment down below. Just let me know that you're here, man. Say, say here if you, if you heard this message. Say here in the comments. Click that like button. Turn on notifications and make sure right, Let's get into it. $100 giveaway at 500 like, subscribers. Know, Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Get this mouth, man. Hit like. Look. Why y'all out here? Okay, oh, fell off. He, he, he ain't, he ain't. Because I don't put out music every day. Because I ain't running to the internet when I wake up looking for validation. That shit don't make me or break me. Been getting money in this shit for 20 years. My house in Calabasas. I got parties at the, you know, annually, man. Know where I'm at. Those parties at that shit annually, left, bro. I ain't even been out of California in a, in a in a minute for not for the duration of no, you know, longer than a few days. This my shit. I've been out here and I'm gonna be out here. I was born in LA and I'm gonna die in LA. Please don't tell me where I can't go. Why you gonna tell me where you gonna die? At? This ain't deep. We ain't. No, if you ain't with me, cool. Don't fuck with me. I don't give a. F I don't give a. F That's truth be told. And again, everybody know what it is with me. Drizzy, he know what the it is with me. Ask him when you see him what it is with Chuck Taylor. Ask Top Dog what it is with Chuck Taylor. Ask Tommy Tom, 2 T, what it is with Chuck Taylor. All of these things I done broke bread with before this internet shit came to be a thing. So if anybody... I ain't gonna lie, let me just quick, quickly butt in right here. I'm not hearing him say that he wasn't left out. I'm just hearing him say a lot of, man, niggas fuck with me, you know what it is type of shit. A lot of reasons why they not feel as though he was quote unquote left out, but he was left out. You weren't there. Anybody asking me how I feel about the shit that K Dog K Dot doing? I think is I think what he doing is amazing. I think what Drizzy doing is amazing. I think the just came out of one of the biggest hip hop beefs ever and survived. Tupac and Biggie didn't. Me and Fifty, we we beef, we survived. Fifty doing his TV thing, that's cool. I'm doing my shit. That's cool. I put fatherhood before all this other shit that y'all materialize. And y'all feel like y'all take that shit and say, oh, game ain't this. You. I don't wake up in the morning to try to prove myself to nobody. I done did it. I done sold platinum records. I done been around the world. I done been on world tours. I'm still getting money off the brand I created in the hood with me and my brother and my homie. You know what I'm saying? So. If you What's that mean? Say, How you get money off uh, off a brand you created in the hood with your brother and your homie? My brother and my homie. You know what I'm saying? How you doing that legally, game? Explain that for us. Take ten seconds out of your time right now if you guys want to think ahead. How he's doing that? Tell me if you think that's legal. Really, I'm gonna give y'all four seconds. That was all four. And so, if you want to say, you know, oh, game, pick this side and pick that side. The game, the game, pick game side. And Drake, that's my. That's some real mature and shit. Kendrick, that's the homie. He know what it is. We came up in this shit. Kendrick watched me do it. Top Dog watched me do it. They had what they had way back then. You know what I'm saying? And I helped where I could help. And ain't nobody gonna take that from you or deny that. Ask these when you see him. Why you talking? Why niggas is running their mouth about this and that? Ask the niggas that y'all. You know what I'm saying? Ask these homie. And at this point, you know, I could be rambling, but I gotta make sure I get it off. I don't do this shit every day, man. But ain't nobody doing, ain't nobody doing, ain't nobody running game nowhere. I'm in L.A. right now. I'm in L.A. I'm going to be in L.A. I was born in L.A. I'm going to die in L.A. My family got roots in Compton. Real roots in Compton. You can ask anybody. My daddy is from Nutty Block. My mom is from Hoover. My brother, R.I.P., my brother Javon, R.I.P., Black Man, I haven't heard ask one Rick reason Rock. as to why ask he feels like. Ask, ask whoever you want to ask about me and my. I just I haven't heard I one on. reason as to why he feels like he. I ain't running from this. Wasn't. I'm here. Period. Like we coming up on the 20th anniversary of the. 
Uh, well, like, bro, you were not involved, bro. Like, why is he not just admitting? Documentary. I'm about to start putting in work on the documentary three. I left off bad and bougie. And um, I'm going to get that shit to my fans. And if you ain't my fan, fuck you. Don't be somebody. So you're going to put out a free tape. I have to talk about game money. Oh. Else fan is good. Crash out. I'm cool. You know what I'm saying? It's love. I done done, I done done a gang of shit for L.A. Game sounds hurt. I paid for a gang of funerals. My homies, it wasn't from my hood. I done gave his money around his wall. Oh, now he's talking about the niggas he gave money. Game is hurt, bro. You know, music in the offices did a gang of shit. Like I said, you can ask any West Coast rapper what it is with me. I'm going to tell you. Chuck Taylor, one of the most solid niggas ever out this. Why y'all wondering why I'm not here and why I'm not there? Shit. I'm doing me. That's why. And everybody that was there was doing them. And like I said again, that shit look good to me. I love to see on the, you know, on the coast on one stage and from different hoods doing their shit. That shit don't make me sad, man. That shit makes me happy. I love to see that shit. Cause I'm a Does he, though? Con. Does he? I'm an L.A. You know what I'm saying? So here's what it is, man. That shit look beautiful to me. But y'all not going to change my morale or make me be this nigga. Well, that no, I'm gonna stay solid. I'm gonna stay solid with whoever stay solid with me. That's real. That's good. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Stay solid. Stay solid. Don't let people influence you. How you treat people. In w game. And that shit. Like that's that, it, you know that shit gonna be what it's gonna be. Me and Top Dog, we solid. If you still here, I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Drop a like on the video. Hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification. Hundred dollar giveaway at five hundred subscribers. The comments right now, like. If Drake, your brother, and, and then how can you? What the fuck, man? Because that's, that's what the I said it is. That's what I said it is. You can't tell me how to feel or make me or make me feel a, a way you want me to feel because you feel like this is like this and that. that. I'm going to tell you straight out my mouth, this is what it is with me. Now, you got your own opinion. You can feel how you want to feel about however you want to feel. Do I think that? And Kendrick and Drake about to see each other and shoot it out? No, absolutely not. I think them is two of the greatest musicians in this to ever do it. So get the they props and go back to y'all life. Some of y'all living shitty ass lives. That's why y'all run into the comments every day trying to pick apart. Like and that's real. That's super real. You guys got to really stop worrying about them too much. You know what I'm saying? You can't worry about them too much. Even though I'm doing a reaction video, you can't worry about them too much, man. These guys have no bearing on your life, and what they got going on has no bearing on your life. As long as you understand that, keep that in perspective, and know that indulge on social media as much as you want. You know what I mean? Let this be a, a funny thing, an objectively. Just don't let this take apart. We give a You know, take a hold of your life. Give a about of that negative ass Not shit. That, never that deep. Take Especially that shit on down the street somewhere. And as far as Game is clearly you know, this behind my back and all that shit, though. podcasters and, and whatever little, you know, rap niggas might feel away or whatever, just say that shit. I'm going to address that shit, guaranteed. And I'm out here, bro. I, I ain't going nowhere. Every know what it is with Chuck Taylor. Hey, listen. Game is giving his response, man. He seems not too, too happy about this. Too happy about people. Try to, uh, I guess, in his opinion, smut his name by saying that he wasn't involved in that. Kendrick didn't really want to fuck with him. I mean, it, it makes sense as to why he'd be mad because we, you know, people. There's a lot of people probably talking that have no idea what's really going on. You know, I'm, I'm an outsider. I'm not from Cali. I'm not from the West. I'm not no blood. I'm not no crib. I'm not. Also, I don't really. I guess in the same way that they'd be mad at Flacco for talking about this shit, they'd be mad at me. But at the end of the day, hey, listen, they're not going to stop me from having my opinion. You guys let me know what yours is down below. Do you think Game is rightfully mad about not being included in this shit? Or do you think that he's kind of uh, 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 justified in in his actions about, you know, or not justified, but do you, do you think he actually is uh, unbothered? I, I don't think he's unbothered. You see, he seems very bothered. Like a lot of the reasons that he gave are more just reasons as to why he kind of should be involved or should have been involved rather than any kind of explanation as to why he wasn't outside of him just saying he's a father now and he's like working on being a dad or whatever the fuck he chose fatherhood over. I don't know how that has anything to do with this, but hey, listen, that's what Chuck said, man. Like I said, drop a comment. Let me know what y'all think down below, what you feel about this whole little situation. Who do you think came out on top either or or as well? Who do you think came out on top? K-Dot or do you think Kendrick uh, or you think Drake came out on top with this, man? Kendrick's got a huge banger. A real, real, real big record, but Drake is also a real big artist who put out some dope records too in response to Kendrick's records. So let me know down below. Turn on the comment, uh, turn on the, the, the notifications.
make sure you hit the subscribe button drop a like on the video hundred dollar giveaway at 500 subscribers and let's try to get this video over 100 likes love y'all see y'all on the next one man